Hi, this is Fab Dupont. We're back at Flux Studios to talk about ClipGuard and the Convert 80 Plus. But first, a little insider information. A lot of high-level mastering engineers don't use limiters. Instead, they crush the hell out of the input stage of their mastering converter. And they use that as a limiter instead of the limiter. It's a different sound. It's more natural if your converter can do it. The Convert 80 Plus has been designed to do that. It can take a lot of heat. I thought this would be best exemplified by a real life situation. I have here a actual session from an actual record by my friend Stoneboy from Brooklyn. Fantastic band, check them out. So I have the Pro Tools session and it is spread across summing, analog summing, using two Convert 8s by Dangerous into a 2 Bus Plus, which is flat, and then into a Bax EQ, which is also flat except for the high pass at 36 Hz and into a dangerous compressor, which is my 2-bus compressor. That is my 2-bus chain, and that goes back into the Convert 80 Plus. So, Pro Tools, Convert 8, 2-bus, Bax, Compressor, 80 Plus, a full mixing rig. If you notice, I'm clipping. Why am I clipping? Because I'm using the dangerous compressor as my two bus compressor to keep it tight, but I'm using the input stage of the Convert 80 Plus to crush the input a little bit to do some slight tasteful limiting. The problem with that, of course, is the clipping. You can see here in Pro Tools, I'm clipping. Say you were mastering and you did that and you send the file, the clip file, to Spotify or Apple Music or Tidal, it would get rejected because it doesn't meet the standards because you're clipping. Or what to do? Here's the solution, clip guard. Once you turn on clip guard, I now have the exact same situation and I'm going in loud as hell, but I have clip guard on and... It's not clipping. Oh, how is that possible? It turns out that this is a piece of Chris Muth's magic, which is now called clip guard. What this does is it lets you turn off the clip LEDs. You can use the input stage as much as you want, you can push it really hard, and this lets you get away with murder. Now, not capital murder, if you're clipping and you hear <laughs> there's nothing the box can do for you. But if you're pushing hard, you're clipping and you like the sound, you can turn off the red light using clip guard. And that is amazing. Mine is on by default. This looks like a limiter, it feels like a limiter, but it's not a limiter. It is a very elegant and transparent way to make sure that you can use this converter exactly the way you want and use the sound of the box according to your religion. And if your religion is loud, make sure clip guard is on. 